as I walked into the lobby that day, there he was. This cute little male terrier that just had a huge smile on his face. It was Jax. Right from the moment I met Jax, I knew he was a great dog. It was pretty sad to see the situation he was in, but it's a reality. We just all have to deal with it. It was pretty sad to watch Jax watch his owner walk out the door, and I knew he had no idea that his life would change forever. And as Jax went through the intake process and got a glamour photo, he was sent to the adoption floor to wait for a family. The Humane Society of Yuma intakes over 8,000 animals in a year, some of which are given up or surrendered. And just like our buddy Jax here, have no idea why they're even at the shelter. And tell us about the pet of the week this week. Well, this is Jax. He is a one and a half year old male terrier blend who is a shy dog. He's very shy in the kennels, but once you get him out, oh, look he's out. awesome. Yep. Yeah, he's awesome. He'll run around the yard, definitely brighten up. So he's good with other dogs. He's doing a, we're doing a special story on his journey through the Humane Society. Aww. So we would love to, whoever adopts him, let us do a follow up interview with him. He's a celebrity yes, in addition is. to being yeah. the pet of the week and a shy. Well, I think he's faking the shyness because, as Cutter just said, once he gets out, he's not shy anymore. Well, you know, sometimes the more subdued, shy dog gets gets the first look. So maybe yeah. he's, maybe it's all part of his uh, oh, yeah. secret plan to, you know. We'll find out when his memoir comes out. <laughs> yeah. yeah, this is true. I have always had dogs, and uh, we have been without one for a couple of years, and uh, I saw Jack's picture in the paper, and a little bio on the dog, the bio on him was a good bio. He captured my fancy, it was simply his picture in the paper. He uh, looked like he belonged to me. So I went down and I permitted him to interview me. He uh, jumped up on my lap as soon as we went into the interview room. In fact, Cutter was there. He was taking pictures of some dogs. I think he, he wanted to be sprung. So uh, we sprung him. It, it was a mutual attraction. I'm Marvin Steiner, and the lad sitting on my lap is Jax, J-A-X. An average day is he goes for his walk between 7 and 8 o'clock. Comes back, he has a full dish of food, and uh, then we hug for a while, and then about 12, 1 o'clock, we'll go for a walk again. And he has made himself at home. You know, he's here as long as I am. He's home. Once you adopt a dog, he's, uh, the dog's part of the family. That, that's all there is to it. So we're bonded. And he is just an excellent companion. 
you folks at the Humane Society have nice kennels. Those, those are nice pens. I believe adoption is the way for most of us to go. Oh my goodness, Jack. Yeah. Thank you so much. You're a lucky dog. Huh? No, I'm a lucky guy. Yeah. Huh? I know.